previously on Minecraft Story Mode. If these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer. That's not what I was expecting. See, <gasps> this is what I'm talking about. We're stuck in a rut, go through a portal, avoid dying long enough to get back to this stupid hallway. Wash, rinse, repeat? Yes. It would be nice if whoever made these left some sort of signs, guideposts. You can call me Harper. Your bravery is an impressive quality. I look forward to studying that aspect of your personality once you have been made useful. We'll see about that. What is that? This is the Redstone Heart. Beautiful. It can help you find your way home. How is this gonna do that? The answers you're seeking, the old builder's atlas, your way home, they're all right up those stairs. Adventure? Wow, that... that's a lot of stairs. And all revealed by the Redstone Heart. Amazing. Yeah, not bad, right? After you. Looks pretty ominous. There's some sort of giant monster up here, another evil computer. No, no, nothing like that, but you'll see. Come on. Ah, <sighs> feels like just yesterday we were building this place. Still don't agree with some of the aesthetic choices. Oh, you just love being mysterious, don't you? Is that like your favorite thing? What? I don't know what you're talking about. I just try not to think about this place very often. Kinda thought I'd never need to come back to tell you the truth. Oh, I'm sensing a story here. I guess you could say that. What are you hiding from us now, Harper? Nothing. Nothing. Well, almost nothing. Just the others might not be 100% happy to see me. Others? You mean we're going to meet more old builders? Still don't like it when you call us that. Yep, but I gotta warn you, they're not as friendly as I am. I'm probably the, uh nicest old builder uh-huh old builder social politics my goodness are you joking you think you're nice yeah i don't know if you remember the whole pama thing but uh hey i had good intentions with that all right don't make me regret helping you well you're gonna give us the atlas and then we can go home right kind of the atlas isn't exactly mine to give it belongs to the other uh old builders. And, well, they might not want to give it up. Why do I get the feeling there's a lot you're not telling us? Good instincts? If they don't want to give it up, then I guess we'll just have to take it. Don't get too hasty on me now. If you play your cards right, they should give you the Atlas. What do you mean? You'll see when you get there. Jesse, come here. Are you sure we can trust Harper? Look at all of our interactions with her so far. They haven't exactly been great, remember? Sort of late in the day to bring this up, don't you think, Lucas? Hey, I'm just trying to be cautious, okay? I want all of us to get home in one piece. And we're going to, okay? We just need to get that atlas. I appreciate the vote of confidence, Jesse. Sorry, I just couldn't resist a good eavesdrop. I promise I'm trying to help, Lucas. You just gotta go through there. A, a door? Like a regular door? Time to step through and find out. Ah, very what? bright. I see a thing. Before you go in there, I have one more piece of advice. Don't die. What? <laughs> ah! Do 
we have here? Seems as if some new competitors have entered the match. My, isn't that special? I just, what in the world did Harper dump us into? Wait, where's Harper? He didn't come with us. Uh, getting very tired of old builders. Hang on, I just realized what this reminds me of. Spleef. Is it in tight? No, it's a game. You try to knock the floor out from other people and make them fall. Ah, be like this! Only decent teammates! Oops, did face me drop something? Looks like the green team team Get Ivor! Lucas, grab Petra quick. <laughs> Thank you, Jesse. I couldn't have done that without you. <laughs> no! Petra! Lucas! No, 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 no! No, no! That's, no. That's impossible! Whoa, no way, dude! I got a double! No! <laughs> Hey, 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 whoa! This is a misunderstanding, dude. What are you doing? Hey! Using weapons is against the rules! Rules? Not cool, dude. So not cool. Ah! Oh! Slab is down. I repeat, slab is down. Stop the match! Not since the days of Tim have we seen such heated play. That's totally against the rules, right? Yeah, I didn't think we could throw TNT back at the gladiators. Nice one, bro. You are an incredibly horrible individual. Ah! Stop! I can tell you dudes are all angry, and I totally feel that, but I promise I do not make the rules here. That's them. Yes, we are the ones in charge here. And we have never had to stop a match, ever. It definitely is strange, Mevia. What is going on here? I want an explanation. Immediately! This is going to require some reconfiguring of the stats, for sure. My friends are dead! You killed them! Wait, wait, wait. A and that's why you're ruining our games? Yeah, come on, jeez! How petty are you? Ugh. Lashing out just because your friends were eliminated. Kind of sore loser behavior, don't you think, sport? It is part of the games. Oh, you can't be serious! <laughs> as serious as that beard of yours. Oh, I'd love to see you try that short stack. That won't be necessary. Your friends aren't dead. Wait, what? How? When people are eliminated in the games, they don't die. <laughs> that would be wasteful. <laughs> Obviously. They come back, and then we have them go work in the mines. Jesse! <clears throat> Your friends are alive and well. It's just a game. Let my friends go. Sorry, sport, but they were eliminated. <laughs> Them's the rules. It's called respawning, champ. We're not monsters. <clears throat> in our games, when people die, they reappear in one of our respawn zones. I hear it's still pretty painful, though. Well, Sport, now that you've come and interrupted our games, I'm sure our fans would love to know how you got here. Spill! Oh, why bother? I don't think that's any of your business. Well, that's cute. Almost as cute as you'll look down in the mine, slugger. <laughs> uh, let's not get hot-headed, Hadrian. Jesse's with me. Well, if it isn't Harper. I must say, this return is unexpected. You're telling me. 
I'm here for Jesse. Oh, really? So tell me, champ, why do you think Harper brought you here? My bet's on Pet. That'd be pretty cute, right? We came for the Atlas. I want you to hand it over so my friends and I can go home. Straight into the point. Well, I'd like it. If I weren't simmering with barely controlled rage right now! Hmm. We're, of course, not going to do any of those things, but... Admirable try. Well, that's all well and good, but I'm confused. Why would we give anything to someone like you? You weren't invited. And you interrupted Spleef. Yeah, ask Harper. She's the one helping. Um, right. Yes. Believe me, Hadrian, when you see what Jesse has, let's just say it will pique your interest. I doubt you'd have anything that would interest us. Oh, send them to the mines. What about this? <gasps> I present the Redstone Heart. Huh. Seems like only yesterday someone took off with that and vowed never to return with it. Oh, but I didn't bring it back. Jesse did. Thing's no toy, Slugger. How about you just hand it over, huh? It can be, uh, pretty dangerous if you don't know how to use it. Uh, nope. This is mine. Not gonna happen. Oh, really? Let me tell you how this is gonna go. Here's the way my offer works. You give me the heart, you and your friends go back down to those portals. I never look at your insignificant face again. Uh, without the Atlas? But we need that to get home. So, not my problem. I don't play that way, Hadrian. If I can't have the Atlas, you can't have the Redstone Heart. Come on, gang, let's get out of here. Oh, wait, 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 hey, whoa, wait, wait, wait. I'm, I'm sure we could reach an agreement that suits everyone. Well, kiddo, I admit, you do drive a hard bargain. I'm, I'm sure I can think of something fair for the both of us. Well, you need the Atlas, and I need competitors. After your unexpected intrusion, I seem to be short a team. So how about this? You play in the games. If you win, the Atlas is yours to keep. It's a good deal, Jesse. Trust me, everyone enjoys these games. I still don't trust you. Don't you worry, Jesse. Once a rule is written into the bylaws, we make sure it's enforced. Isn't that right, Hadrian? Oh, yeah. Otto is a real stickler for the rules. Hmm. All right, then. I suppose we can carry forward with the official oh, addendum. Enough. Add it on your own time. Oh, but there's one other thing I want. If they lose, Harper has to go to the mines, too. Oh, gravel. Harper, want to be a friend and show our new competitors to where they'll be staying? Sure thing. Jesse, this was not part of the plan. Wrapped up in one of Hadrian's deals. Ugh! He's not one to let other people get the upper hand, you know. You lied to me, to all of us. Hey, hey, I didn't lie, per se. I just didn't tell the whole truth. Tricky. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, okay? I really am. Let me show you where the competitor village is. We used to have competitors from all over travel here to play in the games. At least until the others ruined it. What happened? Hadrian and Mevia let power go to their heads. They started pitting people against each other, just for sport. Forcing people to be here. It isn't right. Come on, I'll show you where you'll be staying. Well, here it is, the competitor village, sort of a home away from home for all the people playing the games. They're all in the games. Yep, at least the ones who aren't stuck working in the quartz mines. 
Those poor souls are just waiting for their next shot. Mining is tough work. I feel bad for the people that are too scared or weak to play in the games. Seems like you don't approve. I don't. Believe me, these people would rather be here in the village than working in the mines. They didn't make a deal like you did, Jesse. They're stuck here till they win the games. And if they lose? Hadrian sends them to toil in the mines. If they're lucky, they'll get another shot at the games. But it might take a while. I'm gonna go confer with Otto. We go way back and, well, he's usually the most reasonable of the three. Hold on a moment. We still haven't found Petra or Lucas. <sighs> I'm thinking that Hadrian must have sent them through the portal to the mines which is technically against the rules. No one's supposed to go there until their whole team is eliminated. Hadrian always was one for maximizing useful uh, um, productivity. See what you can do here. I'm going to try and find Otto. I've got confidence in you, Jesse. You might just get out of this. We got to get our friends out of the mines quick. I'll see if any of these other competitors have any promising leads. Aha, uh -huh. there's our nether portal. Um, hello? Don't you hello, face meat! Wait a minute, you're the cheater that blew up my friend, Slab! And face meat doesn't like cheaters. Don't stand around breathing up all of face meat air. Face meat prefers dweeb free air. What do you know about the old builders who run this place? Well, one, they hate being called old builders. Two, they're face meat's bosses. Three, they're not big on hugs. Do you know where my friends are? In the mines. Duh. And they're not going anywhere. Not on face meat's watch. That doesn't mean just stand there, staring at face meat. Get my friends, now. Face meat doesn't negotiate with meanies. Well, hmm, there is something you could do. Face meat was busy slamming mad raps at the gym and missed lunchtime, you see? So face meat's hungry. Do something about that, and face meat will think about getting your friends out. From Spleef, you were like amazing. I'm now, and I am so super sorry about your friend. I get your probs upset, especially since you had no idea what was going on. <laughs> it, um, well, it wasn't very chill. Yeah, I am pretty upset. Totally get it, bra. I will never do that to one of your friends again, because, man, I do not want to be on your bad side. I gotta say, you keep playing like that, and you'll be like, Tim status. Tim who? Tim! Like the legend of Tim Tim, on the signs. Like, one, okay? Like, you could. People could, like, already be talking. They're gonna, like, say stuff. Compare you to Tim. Good, they should pay attention. Whoa, um, I don't know if Tim was that full of himself. Seems a little hubristic, don't you think? <laughs> Listen, I still feel super bad about taking out your friend. I owe you, so if you ever need anything, you just come and ask, shall? No, I mean, seriously, I mean anything at all. Like, I want to help out people. Well, actually, I'm trying to bribe that guard, face me. And he's hungry. Well, um, if I had some wheat, I would totally give you some. Sadly, I don't have a secret stash. And if you didn't ask, I wouldn't loan you some. Wink. Come on, uh, quick before anybody sees us.
Go ahead. That should be enough for your bread. All of it? Of course, brah. It'll grow back. Just, uh, leave the seeds, yeah? One. Planting as I go. And that's another. <laughs> Sweet! And that should all grow back soon. Nice! Looks like that should be enough for some epic loafage. Yeah, that means bread. Hopefully bread will be enough to get that face meat guy to help me. Righteous. They don't let us use crafting tables, though. Then I guess I'll just have to make my own. Where can I get some wood planks? Hey, I remember a bunch of, like, wood planks by the dojo. I think they train by, like, punching them or whatever, you know? Thank you, Nell. Hey, no problem. Happy to help. Catch you later, yeah? Uh, hey. You're the one that eliminated the one decent member of my team. I'll barely be able to get through to the next round. I mean, I know I'm good at this, but I'm not that good. Your stupid teammate killed Lucas. Yeah, I couldn't believe Nell pulled that off either. Don't forget they respawned, duh. Don't cry about it. We were doing what we had to do to win. Until you screwed up everything. Next round! If I don't get you, one of the gladiators will. <sighs> you haven't been here long? So you wouldn't know. But the gladiators are trained for everything. And they are completely under Hadrian's control. Please, they don't seem so tough. Then you haven't been paying close enough attention. Or you're cocky. Either way, bad business. I feel kind of bad for you. Most of us got snatched against our wills, but you got tricked into coming willingly. That old builder should have told you these games were impossible. Looks like Tim won. Yeah, Tim. Yeah, well, good luck with getting home. That should be enough for a table. Aha! That's some fine crafting. Let's make some food. Boom! Bread! Now I should be able to get my friends back. Um, hello? Hey, face meat, got some bread for ya. Bread, huh? Hm. It's not cake, but face meat is starving. Mmm, it's so warm. Oh, and full of carbs. Mmm, fresh bread. It took me a long time to make that bread, so you better hold up your end of the deal. Jeez, face me, didn't know you were so demanding. Wait here. Jesse. Hello. Hey, Ivor. There's been something I've been wanting to say. It's about how you saved me back there in that game. I... I really appreciate it, Jesse. I... Ugh! I couldn't have done it without you, is what I'm trying to say. Ivor, I thought you were gonna die. I worried about that too. Luckily, none of us did. I'm glad you're in this with me, Ivor. Me too, friend. Here! Oh! Boy, response! Jesse. Man, is it good to see you. You too, Lucas. Jesse! I really hope you've got our stuff, because I'm not liking being armorless here. So, I guess that's a no on my journal, too. Sorry. <sighs> Give it to me straight. What did Harper get us into here? Yeah, 
Harper is a tricky one. Now that you guys are out, we need to be careful. If Ivor and I don't win the next round, we're gonna all be sent back through that nether portal. No, no way. Hey, Jesse, I need to talk. <laughs> It's pretty bad in there, Jesse. They don't even do anything to keep the pigmen away, so they just... Uh, stare at you while you mine. Lucas, we need the Atlas to get home. <sighs> I know. Apparently this guy Tim did it. That's true. He's all they talk about in the mines. Guess he won the games a long time ago and got all of his team home. They say he was three blocks tall and that he carried his entire team across the finish line. Tim seems fantastic. Well, you're out of those mines now. According to Harper, until our entire team is eliminated, you're allowed to stay here in the village. That's right. Your friends weren't supposed to go to the mines yet. I am sincerely sorry about that. Jesse, this is Otto, my old friend. Like I said, he may be able to help. Oh, I didn't think he'd come back. Hey, now. I said he would help. That's why we're here. Harper's been filling me in about you. From the story she's told, I'm impressed. You might actually make it to the top. In fact, you're the most exciting thing to come to this place in a long time. A real wild card. Yeah, I think you might be a real Tim in the making. Yep, a real Tim. Really interesting, you being here. Tim, please. I could do anything he can do better. Well, you might just be right about that, Jesse. I'm rooting for you, kid. Just don't disappoint me. Can we trust him, Harper? Who knows? Otto's been doing this forever. At least he seemed interested. Anyway, dorms are over there. You got a big day tomorrow, Jesse. Oh, that sounds awesome. Can't wait to just sit for a little while. And in the morning, I'm winning and getting us all out of here. I just hope this next event isn't too... deadly. Hello, competitors, and welcome to the next day of the games. <laughs> It's gonna be a hot one. Woo! Yes, it is, Adrian. And how are our teams looking, Otto? Well, Mevia, purple, green, and yellow are still making a strong showing. But after yesterday's performance in Spleef, I'm afraid to say that the red team has been completely eliminated. Oh, I guess it's back to the mines for them. <laughs> and of course, about our plucky newcomers. Otto. Shut up. We don't need to hear about them. Well, for everyone else, don't forget to be like Tim out there. Certainly fond of their own voices, those three. Oh my gosh, I'm so sick of these pompous jerks. Yes, I can't say I'm terribly fond of them either. All right, competitors, the next event is almost upon us. Time to head to the starting line. Starting line, huh? Oh great, a run for my life. Just what I was hoping for. Bad knees. Beardo? Boom! Surprise locker room visit! Ha! How we doing, everybody? It's Hadrian! And here are the newcomers that everyone's been talking about since their <laughs> explosive debut in Spleef. Tell me, champ, what's on your mind as you approach the next challenge? Make sure you smile when that spotlight's on you. I'm not gonna be in your twisted interview, Hadrian. Get out of my face. Oh, I'll get out of your face. But I'll be laughing at your face from my nice cushy box while I watch you burn. Oh, I promise you that, you little nothing. <gasps> Listen up, bucko. These are supposed to be games. These are supposed to be fun. So play along. I sincerely hope that we understand each other. These games might be yours, Hadrian, but we're gonna beat you. Well, that's a rather hilarious bit of fiction you're slinging, isn't it? Yeah. So funny that I forgot to laugh. Well, aren't you some bold little so-and-sos? Watching you burn is gonna be extra satisfying. 
<laughs> what a lovely day for a game. Jesse, good luck out there. I'm sure you'll be great, but... Uh, well, everyone could always use a little dose of luck, right? You wishing me good luck? Come on, Em, that sounds pretty suspicious. Maybe we got off on the wrong foot earlier. I'm sorry. I was just mad about my old teammate you eliminated. Well, I was thinking about how you handled Spleef, and then you made that deal with the old builders, and I thought, an enemy of my enemy is my friend. M wanting to work together. Hmm. I'm not surprised. We are very charming. So, uh, yeah. How about we work together on this? I could use an ally. And you could use my help. <laughs> Come on, Jesse. I'm trying to help you out here. Oh, come on, Em. You expect me to believe that? What are you up to here? Nothing, honest. It's just watching you negotiate with Hadrian, trying to get home. It inspired me. It made me want to go home, too. We should be working together. In the middle of the race is a part with tons of gladiators. That's when we should all team up. Defeat them. Then race to the finish. Well, what do you say? Unless you don't want the help of a former gladiator. I'm gonna stick with my team, and you should stick with yours. Fine. I'll do that. Competitors, to the starting line. See you at Gladiator Junction. Good, we don't need them, Jesse. Team Jess 4 has this one down. Or is it Team Icy? I don't know about this, Jesse. Cardio isn't really my thing. If I were Hadrian, I'd be up to some suspicious activity. Come on, Ivor, I know you can unleash the fury out there. Show them what you got. You're right, Jesse. I'm going to show those old builders what Ivor is made of. See? It is a total bummer that we are not going to be able to, you know, work together. Competitors, on your mark! Get set! Go! We did it. I love a good lava base build as much as the next guy. Get ready to witness some greatness. Greatness, huh? Huh? Out of the way, chumps. Sounds like this is Gladiator Junction, but where are the gladiators? Ha <laughs> ha. 
that doesn't make any sense. Why aren't they... You're mine. I've been dreaming about this since sleep. Wow, your memory goes back that far? <laughs> Fire away! Bye, Squishy. Potion of leaping! <laughs> oh, crap! Gotcha! Looks like you're all alone yeah, now. That's math. You're gonna pay for that one, Clutch. Prove it. No, you don't. <laughs> Here comes the boom. Dude, I am like so close. I could do this. Sorry, Nell. I'm winning this thing. Hey! Whoa, whoa, Jesse! Way to catch up, dude. Very nice. You just can't take a hit, can you? Get huh? dunked on! Whoa! Slacker! Hang on. Whoa! No! Looking a little swordless there, Jesse. Burning the flint and steel. Boy, am I glad I've still got you. Soon we will have a winner, and I think I know who it will be. <laughs> I'm surprised that Jesse has not respawned yet. <laughs> Me too, Mevia. Me too. What? And in an unexpected twist and something that definitely was not planned... Jesse wins! Jesse wins! Jesse. And there appears to be a confrontation on the field. Bet you didn't think I'd win, but I did. This just went from bad to worse. You did whatever it took to win that race, Jesse. Good to know. And you, you were supposed to eliminate Jesse. Our deal's off. Deal? No, no please. probably think I'm scum or whatever, but you know what? I don't even care. You have your deal, Jesse. If you win, you and your friends will just leave us anyway. My shot at going home just went up in smoke. So feel free to judge all you want. Hard to hurt me any more than Hadrian did just now. Whatever, you're a liar. Why should I waste my time talking to you? Ugh, fine. That respawning was the worst thing that's ever happened to me. Ah! Ivor, what are you wearing? <gasps> it's what I've been wearing under my adventuring clothes. It breathes wonderfully. Uh huh. Well, look who it is. You. Hadrian wants you. Hadrian? Why does he want to see me? You made him real mad. Come on, I don't have all day. I'm warning you, Jesse. You're a little mad too, aren't you? Because they won? No. Remember? When you tried to stop me, but I was like, ah. yeah, Okay, fine. I'm mad that he wouldn't let me kill you a few times before I brought you upstairs. And you should know I asked. Come on. No. 
Just Jesse. Hadrian doesn't allow dirty respawns in the palace. Just try and be safe, Jesse. I don't trust them. Hey, psst. I need to talk to Keep you. Keep up. Come on. Come here. It'll be quick. Jesse, you gonna do what I say or not? Hey, Jesse. Yeah, over here. Jesse, I'm warning you. Give me one sec. I want to talk to him. You're gonna get me in trouble. Hurry up. Hey, what's up? Hi, Jesse. I'm Sebastian. Um, I know you're about to see the old builders, and I just wanted to say, please, just don't make them mad. Whatever they want you to do, just do it. It is way worse for us when they're mad. We're just happy you're here. I know, you're so busy. I, I'm just a minor. I'll keep that in mind. Thank you, Sebastian. Phew. Okay. Good. I don't want to keep you, but some of the miners and I, well... We made you something. I know it's not much, but it's all we have. Wow, thank you. You didn't have to do this. Jesse, come on! Uh, now we're gonna be late and I'm gonna get in trouble. Just the most not cool. Quit whining, Slab. It's super unbecoming. Oh, I am gonna enjoy squishing you at some point. Wow, so this is how the old builders live. Totally epic, right? Sometimes I just like to stand here and... Nah, eh, I've seen stuff way more epic than this. Oh, really? Hm. I bet you're just making that up, snob. But why am I standing around? I, I gotta go find Hadrian. Thanks to you, we're late. Oh. And don't touch anything! Slab said don't touch anything. He never said don't look at everything. Tim's armor that now belongs to Jesse. So, ah! I see you found Tim's armor. Gotta say, Jesse, I'm surprised that you try and steal that armor. Considering everyone is calling you the new Tim, well, doesn't seem like a very Tim thing to do, does it? Yes, I've heard the rumors that they're calling you that, and I can definitely see why people love an underdog story. You like sneaking up on people? Funny thing to say, coming from the person I caught snooping around my office. You can look closer, go ahead. I assume by now you've heard all about Tim. Repeatedly. Everyone loves him. And why shouldn't they? I can't say I'm much of a Tim fan myself. And why would you be? You haven't lost yet. Tim is an inspiration to them, even when he's not here. One could say he's an inspiration because he's not here. What do you mean? It's so much easier for a legend to stay nice and shiny when it's a fond memory. Easier to control it. I've been watching your legend grow, but I worry that with you still in the picture, it could get... messy. I've been starting to think it would be best if you made a quiet exit. You don't belong here. These games aren't for you. I don't really do quiet exits. Do you have any idea who you're talking to? I could ask the same of you. I know a lot more than you might think, Sparto. See, there's something you should know about the games. No one ever wins unless we want them to. Not even Tim. Let that sink in for a moment, eh? I'm not buying it, Hadrian. Is Tim even real? I knew you were a smart one, bucko. <laughs> Of course he's not real. Tim gives them hope. He keeps them playing the games, but no one wins. Ever. Which is why I think it'd be in your best interest to play along. 
But don't you miss your friends? Your treehouse? Wait, my treehouse? The Atlas can see where people are from, you know. So I had Mevia go check it out. Turns out you're pretty famous. I was impressed. Had to bring back some things you might be interested in. <laughs> Uh, ah! Axel! Olivia! Hey, Jesse! Oh my gosh, I can't believe you're here! Yeah, this really scary lady showed up and knocked us out. Now we're in these smelly boxes. What's going on here? And that guy's voice is the worst. I can even hear it through the obsidian. Not gonna lie, guys, it's bad. We're in a world where everyone is forced to compete in these crazy games and will be prisoners forever if I don't win. Uh, that is bad. I'm so sorry you guys got roped into this. Yeah, that's not the best. Wait until I tell the others you're here. I've missed you guys so much. Wow, this is just, wow. Such a tapestry of human trauma and emotion. And we haven't even gotten to the best part. I saved that for last. What? Oh, yes. Your best friend, Reuben. Sup? I've heard all about him. Your best friend. Hadrian, for an old builder, you are not that bright, you know that? What? I told you, bro, but my name is Reuben, but the Reuben you're thinking of he was like a little piggy. Though seriously, dude, big fan. Mavia. So you used the Atlas to kidnap my friends and that other guy. Why? Yeah, incentive, Jesse. Incentive. See, even if you win, and that's a mighty big if, they will be staying to work in the mines forever. Or until they get a shot at competing, which is still basically forever. No! Okay, so what's your deal? If you lose the next match and go work in my mines, then I'll let your friends go. All of them. You'll just have to stay behind in their place. I hear it's terrible in those mines. I don't believe it. You're just a dirty cheater. You know that I'm gonna win, so you're just trying to stack the deck however you can. You wound me, Jesse. Your barbed words. Ouch. Okay, I had hoped that watching your sad reunion would be entertaining, but I'm done now. What do you say, sport? Your freedom for theirs, huh? Do you think you're worth more than all of them? No way, Hadrian. I don't make deals with cheaters. Fine. We'll play it your way. Which is to say, I will crush you, and you won't win anyway. Slab, get this garbage out of my office. Sure thing, boss. Come on, idiot. Uh, 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 uh. You're okay! What happened up there? Have you seen what Ivor is wearing? I said <laughs> shut up! Hadrian has Axel and Olivia. What? what? He used the Atlas to snatch them from our world. No. Are they okay? Other than Hadrian having them trapped in obsidian prisons. But he offered me a deal. He said he'll send you all home if I lose and go to the mines in your place. I didn't take the deal. Oh, I guess that was probably the right move. Probably? <laughs> what, you thought that deal sounded good? I don't know. It's a complex situation. I don't trust Hadrian. No way was I going to take any shady deal from him. You're right. You're probably right. <sighs> Jesse was smart. Hadrian never would have kept that deal. Even if you did volunteer to throw the game, he'd just send you all to the mines anyway. Probably, while claiming that was the original deal. So who's supposed to help us then? Hadrian and Mevia are both clearly the worst. But what about the third guy? Otto? How could he help? He's always stayed out of the more lever-pulling sides of the games. He seems like a big fan of the rules. Maybe we can use that to our advantage. <laughs> he loves rules, that's for sure. Always plays by them. If you won, I know he would definitely make sure you got that atlas. That was the original deal, and he's an honorable man. 
We're gonna end these games for good. Think you can handle that, Harper? Oh, I think I've got some <laughs> ideas. Wait, wait, wait. You really think you can free everyone in this place and win the games? Yeah. Good luck with that last part. Do you really think you can just beat all the other teams by yourself? That is a pretty tall order. Even for you, Jesse. Oh, it's impossible is what it is. Em, you are seriously damaging my flow by being such a downer. Either get on my side or get out of here. I'm just being realistic. If you really think you can get all the teams to not fight each other, then go right ahead. Whoa, looks like we've got a little bit of an audience here. I think that's your cue to do your thing. Tomorrow we have to stand up to the old builders, together! Um, actually, I think you mean the gladiators. They're the ones that keep kicking our butts in the games. Uh, actually, actually, the gladiators work for the old builders, and they never want us to be able to win. Hadrian keeps twisting and changing the rules. I say it's our time to change the rules on them! What's the point? Hadrian will still have all the power. There's no way he's gonna let us just take that from him. He'll just make up some new rule. The point is, just shut up and let me talk, okay? Oh, snap. Well, fine. I'll hear you out, but nobody beats Hadrian at his own games. Nobody. Hey, Tim did. That's the only thing keeping me going in here. Actually, Tim's not real. <gasps> That's... No way. Of course Tim's real. Look at the banners. Are you sure? Yeah, Hadrian told me. I knew it. All of that stuff about him seems so implausible. So wait, Tim's made up. They just invented him. What a highly elaborate fabrication. Yeah, no one really wins these games. <laughs> but we can beat the old builders. The old builders already controlled everything else. Of course they control the games. Why should I even try anymore? Sitting in their stupid tower, pulling all the levers. Like they got us all on leashes. What, like you're just going to quit? Yeah. Quitting is like for a quitters, dude. I'll be sure to remember that. The next time I've got a gladiator aiming for my head with an enchanted sword. Yeah, I mean, like, your plan to take down the old builders sounds cool and all, but, um, those gladiators are, like, super tough. <laughs> like, max-level scariness, okay? Boo! Oh, no, no, I mean, totally OP. Those gladiators are a bunch of tough cookies. Definitely true. No way any of you stand a chance against them. Uh, where's Jesse going with this? But that's just because you've never had a leader to help you make a plan. You've never had me! Oh, I get it now. Okay, now just bring it home, Jesse. You can do it! Doing awesome. That's very oddly inspiring. Yeah! Not real! I can't believe it! Look, it was a nice speech. But strength doesn't come from speeches. Actions speak louder than words. Can't expect you to just talk your way through this, Jesse. I'm done trying to help you. I've got all these other people to worry about. You don't know anything. Man, some crowd. Think they got through to him? Wait, so who are we fighting then? <sighs> Reaction definitely seemed mixed. We're doomed. I don't know how we're gonna pull this off. What? Of course we're gonna pull this off. You're Jesse. Yeah, we can still do this. Well, I guess we'll find out for sure in the morning. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is my privilege, nay, my honor, to be here today kicking off another wonderful day of... The games! That's right, Hadrian. And not just any day, but the final day of the game! Are our competitors ready for the final challenge? 
the, it's walls. the walls. So, scared? Because it's okay if you are. No one will <coughs> judge you for it. After putting up with your breath this whole walk? Please. This walls thing doesn't scare me at all. <laughs> Still got your sense of humor, huh? Cute. Maybe I. For those unfamiliar with the walls, you want to walk us through how it's played? Sure thing, Hadrian. Teams start out separated in their own sections, divided by the high inner walls. Each team has a short amount of time to gather materials, build defenses, and craft in their section before the walls come yeah. down. Wait, I only see dirt and gravel in my section. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that gonna be a problem? The sections are drawn at red. Oh, you work for the worst people. Did you know that? Yeah, but that dental plan, though. See? Once the walls are down, it's every team themselves. But is surviving the walls the end, Mevia? No, it is not, Hadrian. Whichever team survives the free-for-all needs to step onto the winner's platform in the center of the arena. Winner takes all! But let's not get ahead of ourselves, because that's only if the would-be winners can defeat... Oh. Gladiators! <laughs> that's right! So all competitors better get to gathering materials because that clock is ticking! Too dark. Well, hopefully it's not all dirt and gravel. Oh, choices are funny, aren't they, Mevian? What do you mean, Hadrian? Some choices Gravel? Places. Gravel, that's worse Others than dirt! Get you nothing but dirt and gravel in your section. Ah. <laughs> oh, it's true, it's true! Yep, just dirt. If I didn't convince people to join up with that speech, I'm gonna need something to work with. Nope, just dirt. Come on! At least they gave me a crafting table. Now if only I actually had anything to craft with. Hey! <laughs> Seems like they're happy you didn't get anything. <laughs> I think they're making fun of you. But just my, you know, professional opinion. As a gladiator. Who's heard this a lot? <laughs> Oh my gosh, do you really think so? That's terrible. Oh, wow, I mean, yeah, C could you not tell? I hate you. Oh, do you know what time it is? Ask me what time it is, Mevia. What time is it, Hadrian? It's time for the walls to come down! Uh. This should be interesting. Competitors are like wild ocelots, sizing each other up, unmoving, before they go in for the kill. <clears throat> Hang on now, we M got moving. Really? Looks like the gladiator formerly known as Emily is preparing her attack. And Jesse, the newcomer, is just painfully unarmed and unprotected. Jesse. This could get ugly. Let's hope. Now hang on, Em, you don't have to do this. Already made up my mind. Jesse isn't even trying to defend himself. Here it comes! The finishing blow! What? <laughs> Thought maybe it was time for me to start helping you. It appears Emily has offered Wow, to am I glad that this is how this went down gone. because uh, let me tell you, all I had was dirt and gravel. Gross. Could still come in handy though. What is Em doing? Why is she doing that? I have no idea. Come on, over here. Yeah. Why aren't you all killing each other? Yeah, see, usually all the little teams kill each other. If I were you guys, I would put down your weapons. Yeah, but then we'd have nothing to defend ourselves if you attacked us. <gasps> kind of the point. Don't you see? None of us are the enemy. It's them. 
They're the enemies. They're behind everything. Oh, my head hurts. Too many perspectives. And it appears that the gladiators are being idiots right now. Idiots! Wait, what the You are not going to bully us. Wait, wait, wait. Hadrian's the bully, not us. Woo! That's a relief. Oh, imbeciles! Lab? Lab! What should we do? Uh, uh, uh. I'm sure, I'm sure that the slaughter, that the slaughter will, will, will commence soon, right? Out of our way, you big lugs. We've got business with your bosses. That's some tough talk from someone so puny. Yeah. Not going with them, Slab? Big lug? That is just straight up insulting. I am big and beautiful. Get some manners. I think it's time for us to finish this together. It appears all the competitors are headed towards the victory platform. As stated in our rules, anyone who is not eliminated may step on the victory platform and win the games. It looks like they are going to do this together. Right behind you, fearless leader. That won't happen. It can't happen. No, no! And they've done it. The competitors have all stepped onto the platform together, which, by the Builder Game Bylaws, means they are all the winners! Which I'm sure my colleague means to say, we are going to find some way to disqualify them? No, we are not. They all win. No! Levia, Otto, with me. We're ending this. So help me, none of you will leave this place until you eliminate each other! Just give it up already, Hadrian. I beat you at your own dumb game. Really? Really? You think you beat me? Oh, that just shows how little you understand the circumstances of your situation. This isn't up to you. We control the games. We decide their outcome. Mevia. Shut up, Otto. This runt needs to pay for ruining our fun. So you admit the games are rigged then? <laughs> Sure! Okay, sure, fine, whatever. Maybe, yeah. Jesse won these games fair and square. He's earned the Atlas. Otto, I would think very carefully about what you're doing. I have. Jesse, with the power vested in me as an officiator of the Builder Games, I am proud of... Hey, Otto! Hey, Otto. Maybe, what are you doing? Now it's been fun. Really, but I think it's about time we end this. Surrender the Redstone Heart now. Now, because uh, I will trap you here forever. You want the Redstone Heart? You're gonna have to pick it out of my inventory. Fine by me. The hard way's more fun anyway. Ah! Oh, this is useless. Well, well. Just when you thought it Fine, go! I don't need you, coward. Run away, little Emily. You're gonna need all... All the help you can get, Jesse. Time to take what is mine. I'll admit your quick sport, but not quick enough for my axe! Oh, what the... Don't forget my axe, Hadrian! <laughs> Gotta admit, kid, you've shown you got skills, but you're still no We'll magic. see about that. I got this, Hadrian. Had enough, Hadrian? Wait, wait! You're right. This has gone too far. It was just supposed to be a game. You expect me to believe that? Come on, sport. Haven't you ever had anything get away from you before? I mean, can't you forgive me? <laughs> <gasps> this game is... No! And that's our game, sports fans. The Redstone Heart has been returned to its proper owners. <laughs> I, 
I lost. It's over. I... Oh, I don't think so. It's us! Yeah! I'm so happy to see you guys. I know you said you were done helping me, but I hope you can give me another chance. You know, because I'm awesome. And we both need to get out of this. I actually wouldn't mind a little help. Looks like an understatement to me. We got you, buddy. But I lost my inventory when I respawned. How am I supposed to get the Atlas back without any weapons or armor or anything? Well, we may have made a little stop in Hadrian's inventory room and helped ourselves to a few things. Awesome. Here, buddy. Wow. Take this. Thanks. Hey, suspenders. Over here. Tim's armor. Belongs to you now. Time to kick some old builder butt. Now to pick a weapon to go with my sweet new armor. Ooh, yeah, nice choice. Bad. Sweet. Payback ah, time. Eliminate! Now what should we do with all those other competitors who betrayed us? Well, Mevia, spending eternity in the quartz mines doesn't seem like punishment enough. <laughs> I have something special in mind for them. Hadrian! Mevia! This game just went into overtime. Well, isn't that cute? You found Tim's armor! Time for you to be eliminated! <laughs> Please. Not gonna happen, chump. Oh, I'm gonna enjoy crushing you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna owe you one. Time to go to work. No, no, it can't be! You just meant me a give up! <laughs> wow, her inventory was huge. Mavia, come on! What kind of rookie move was that? Ta-ta for now, bucko. Hey, Hadrian! Huh? Over here! You mess with one member of the Order of the Stone. You mess with all Go, of Jesse. us. Go, Jesse! I Time believe in you! Time to shut you up! You take this as going to help? You're deluded! I will personally see to it that you and your friends will forever suffer! Shut up! Just shut up! All of you, shut up! I see you don't like having a live audience, Hadrian. Jesse, remember Splee! Got it. Now, Mevia, we have to get out of here. Come on! Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, guys. How's it going? <laughs> it's going not the best, and you're not going anywhere. Yeah. Face Meat wants to discuss his benefits plan. Oh, now hang on, hang on! What? Jesse, you did it! Again. Feels like I say that a lot. I couldn't have done anything without all of you. Well done, Jesse. An excellent job. Uh, thanks, Otto. You have truly shown my friends and I the error of our ways. 
I'm glad to put this whole messy business behind us. Yeah? Because I'm not sure if I believe how sincere you are. And you are completely within the right to feel that way, Jesse. E completely. Your caution shows wisdom. Ah! Ah! No! You have fairly defeated them. Seems only fair that you get to decide their fate. And with the Atlas, you can send them anywhere you want. Hmm. You know, there was this game that Olivia and I used to play back in our treehouse. Huh? Remember? We called it, Which Would You Rather Fight? And that's when I yanked Pama's redstone heart right out. And the whole thing shut down! Man, you guys have had some crazy adventures. So many people trying to kill you. Goodbye, Jesse. Goodbye. Thank you. That all of them? Everyone that wants to go home anyhow. Except you folks, that is. I can't believe how many competitors actually want to stay and keep playing the games. Thanks to you, my intrepid new friend, I can actually work on making them fun again. Very exciting. It'll be more challenging just by myself, but a good challenge. What kind of people would want to stay? Seems kind of weird. Uh, well, uh, they are pretty fun games, you know. Admittedly, they got a little, uh, well, out of hand before, but I'm going to make sure that doesn't happen again. I'm bummed my journal never showed up. Had a lot of good stuff in there. Yeah, I'm sorry, Lucas. Well, Em, how about you? You said you wanted to go home, right? Yes, I just can't decide if it's what I want. You get to leave and go on more adventures. Do I really want to go back to farming? I mean, it has been ages since I've seen it, and I miss my friends. I'm sure that you're just getting cold feet now that you actually can go home again. You said it's all you wanted in life, remember? Yeah, yeah, you're right. I'll be able to see my own friends again. Maybe we can have our own, you know, Order of the Stone. Yeah, and you can have your own adventures. Thanks, Jesse. I needed that. Hey, Ivor. Oh, hello. What you doing? I was just observing Harper, all by herself, over there. She seems lonely. Come on. You're amazing. So, how do we get home now? Well, the Atlas belongs to Jesse now. The deal's a deal and all that. Sweet. Uh, how does it work? Now you just say where you want to go, and the Atlas will show you the way. Why don't you just go ahead and open it? Okay, Book. Take us home. Whoa! Spectacular! Incredible! Wow. Nice! There it is. Home. Figure it's about time we get heading on home, huh? That sounds awesome. Yeah! Home, here we come. Jesse, look! Can you believe it? We made it! We're home! After all that time, all those portals, we're home! Oh, come on, was there ever any doubt? Of course we made it home. Well, I wouldn't say I doubted you, but, uh, for a while there, I almost forgot what home even looked like. Ah, <sighs> it is good to be back. 
I'm just so glad we're all back together. That atlas is so cool. I'm glad Otto let you keep it. Fabulous, yes! And that's not all we got. Seriously? What else did you get? Yeah, show him, Jesse. The Enchanted Flint and Steel. The one that started the whole thing. Yeah, none of these other adventures could have happened if it weren't for this. The crown of the Eversource, the magical source of all of Sky City's precious materials. Whoa, wicked! The mask of Cassie Rose, AKA the White Pumpkin. Oh man, that's even creepier looking than I imagined. Pama's Redstone Heart. I know that Pama was evil and everything, but I still kind of wish I could have seen it. The Portal Atlas. Back. I could have lost all the rest so long as we got to keep that. Ha! Huh? I wonder what Soren would have thought of it. So much power contained within such a tiny Whoa. object. Easy there, Ivor. Mm. Sorry. I can't believe you got to do all those incredible things. Makes sense, though. You were gone a long time. Wait till we show you all the improvements we've been making to town. Hang on. What is it? Wasn't that where the portal atlas was a minute ago? Yeah, that was definitely where you put it. Guys, Flint and Steel are missing, too. And where's Ivor? He must be headed for the portal network. Is that bad? What should we do? I mean, I guess he mostly knows what he's doing. Well, let's not waste time hanging around. We have to stop him. In a very unfortunate and unexpected turn of events, it appears we are in the land of zombies that are indeed the size of chickens. Zombies that are the size of chickens. That's right, Adrian. And it looks like they're dying to meet us. <laughs> Get it? Because they're undead and they're dead. Oh, never mind. Not your best work, Navia. 